Hey there, everybody. Welcome to Trilogy Gaming. We are back with Pokemon Randomized Real Edition for Omega Ruby, episode 19. And, uh, all right, let's just talk about it. Let's, 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 let's talk about it, right? Thank Arceus, you know, is the mon we were hoping for. Um, Defiant boosts the Pokemon attack stat when its stacks are lower because its attack stat can just go infinitely up. I mean, it's kind of down because of it, you know. But, you know, whatever. Mist Balls are right. Wake Up Slaps are right. You know, um, Wake Up Slaps are right. Swallows Ant, Magnum Bomb. We just have to hope it's going to get some. Obviously, we have the Lucky Egg to try to level it up. Um, and we definitely need to level it up. So we'll switch it in when we need to. Best Gen 4 Mon we could have asked for to wrap up last episode. Uh, but obviously, when we look at the team, we can see the Sceptile's gone. Um, I think he was the weakest link. And if, honestly, I, I'm making this, if Precious Snake does not turn out to be a decent Mon when evolves Dragonite, I will bring back in Sceptile. I just thought the move pool, the fact this it can, has rest, it has head charge, you know, uh, eruption and relic songs okay, but like because it has self healing and such a good BST when it evolves, unless it just doesn't get a junky ability, uh, we may not go back to Sceptile. Now, if it turns out to be a really bad ability, um, we will move on. So we also have another big problem here, guys. The scope got us Arceus last time. This Pokemon is in a city. Usually we spin the wheel for each new route and area. But for the city, I almost is going to treat this like a give me. So we're going to be able to just catch whatever Mon this is. If this is another Arceus though, um, we're not going to use two. We're just going to run. Oh, it just flees. I thought we were able to battle it. Never mind. That's all that problem. There we go. All right, so let's go grab the item up here because I would love a good item. Mist Ball? Are you kidding me? Okay, um, the disappointment I have in what we just got is kind of real. However, what does Sofa King have on him? He's generically psychic, so changing it back. Sacred Fire, Focus Blast. Dark Pulse. It's, it's missed it. it is better than Needle, but Needle Arm can make. I think at this point, I'm going to give him Mist Ball just so he can turn back into a Psychic type because he is Protean. But also, if we have to just launch it right off the bat, um, we'll save this right now. Then, you know, Protean really doesn't do much, but yeah. So obviously, guys, we have Renona's Gym. I am going to, I am a little concerned about our Pokemon's levels, I gotta be honest. But we're gonna battle everyone, and if the battles seem easy, we'll try to switch Arceus in. If we're having a tough time, we will have to play this by ear, truth be told. All right, so here we go. Cub Chew. Well, interesting. So this is gonna be an Ice Gym. So maybe we should throw in, you know, right now I'm actually thinking something actually kind of wild. Wait, hold on. This they're supposed to be tight. Sneasel is an ice. Wait, hold on a minute. What's Cub Shoes typing? Hold on. I'm looking this up really quick because these gems are supposed to be type based cup is pure ice right yeah so sneasel's coming in and sneasel isn't ice is he oh he's dark ice he is why was i thinking he wasn't ice i was thinking about hasui and sneasel some reason I was thinking I, I combined regular Sneasel and Hisui and Sneasel. I was thinking he's dark and I was thinking he was fighting. And fighting is the other typing on the Hisui and he's fighting poison on Hisui. I literally just tried to combine two in my head. Or am I kidding me right now? I literally just did that. I can't believe I did that. I 
I've been trying to research more of the new mons, and honestly, I think it just came back to bite me in trying to think of something else. Oh, I should not have brought him in. Who is it who has eruption? I am now, I think it is, I think it's Sofa King. Rano Shock. Okay, as long as you don't poison. That's just Sacred Fire. Ah, Sneasel's was fast. Also, Sofa King's kind of slow. Protean. The blue flames are still so cool. So, here's the big thing though. I'm almost thinking we can get away by leading Arceus and switching him out. I feel like we could actually get away with that. Because when it comes down to it, right, we have to think about the Pokemon typing and Ice Weakness is usually... Wait, Fighting. He has Wake Up Slap. Also, Steel. Magnet Bomb could also damage. Maybe we just lead Arceus for a battle and see if Arceus can actually do something. Yeah, I'm, I'm purposely trying to say both just to mess with people. I know a lot of people still call him Arceus and Arceus. Like, and I don't know why it's so wildly different, but it is. But it has, like, the Arc in his name, right? Snow Run, okay. So which one do we think will do more damage? Probably Wake Up Slap, right? But yeah, it's Arceus, right? Or Arceus, it's Arceus, right? Let's just try both. Wake Up Slap does make it faint. Now, he is not getting a lot. Silver King, uh, Spit Up does not help us, no. Yes, we will give up on that. We will violently give up on that. All right. Yeah, and we just cannot let him faint. We will switch out if we need to. Uh-oh. Oh, yeah, we have to go this way and then wrap around again. Man, that just leads back to the beginning. Hey, buddy, we're going to battle every single one of you. I'm just waiting which one of them is going to have the legendary ice types, you know? Which one of them is going to have that big Mon that's a threat? An Alex? Okay. This will actually be kind of a good test here. Let's see if Wake Up Slap can take care of this. No, only does about half. Okay. Trick Room. Okay, Trick Room isn't going to help too much frustration. Take some damage, break up slap. I'm hoping this gives good experience. We need him um, to gain it. Oh, that's fat experience. Also, a good move would help too, like a really good move. Nothing there. Bear tech. Bear tech is cool. We saw Cup you earlier, so that's cool. Let's try Magnet Bomb really quick. Elite Seed. That's gonna be annoying. Yeah, okay. Oh, that was a crit. So Wake Up Slap, I think, probably does more altogether. Rolling Kick. I flinched. Wow. Okay, we may need to be careful with this here. One kick. Don't flinch again. There we go. That should kill. It does. Thank God. Okay. That was a little slow there at the end. Ton of experience. That's what we love to see. Okay, we're going to play smart and actually heal him up a little bit. Um, I wish we, you know, could cheese some sort of heal mechanic on him. But we don't have anything that can really, uh, heal, right? Um, I 
Actually, I haven't checked all the stuff he can learn here. Alright, hold on a minute. Does not learn Dazzling Gleam, that's unfortunate. No, I did. I didn't want to give him any abilities I could overly miss. Okay. Oh, we're healing. We're healing. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. We're gonna grab, um... Let's just give him a soda pop. That'll be fine. We just gave God a soda. I, I'm just gonna pretend like I didn't think about that one too much. Okay, let's go this way. He was even looking at me. That's BS. I know it triggers, but like, dude wasn't even looking at me. Good job, Whirly Cheater. But now like, okay. Snow Cone versus God, who will win? Um, I think God. Yep. Okay. That's pretty good. That's pretty good. Okay. Decent experience. We're not too worried about it. Okay, so let's just battle you. Get it out of the way. So, okay. And it's swine up. Oh, so based off the ice Pokemon we haven't seen, we kind of know what potentially the final trainer could have. Because usually they don't stack up. Let's just magnet bomb here. It does not kill. Smackdown. Just magnet bomb again. So, interesting enough. Let's see. Pilo Swine, maybe. Okay. Well, let's just go see, because I think after this. Then we go this way, and then we go this way. And then here. Alright, we do have to be careful about losing lives here. I'm going to save. Uh, so, hey, girly, can you, uh, yeah, can you stop feeling the wind? Can you stop, like, you know, being a dog, sticking your head out the window for a second and come talk to me? Just battle me. Could you imagine being a real Pokemon and, like, a Pokemon trainer and going up to these guys and be like, I want to challenge you. Hold on, I need to go on a 10-minute speech about the elegance of wind. I'm, I'm good. I'm gonna go, you know, I'm, I'm gonna go. Uh, oh, Roars. All right. Big Dino. It's Littlefoot. We're fine. Um, let's just Magna Bomb. I think two of these might be able to take it out. Yeah. Try attack. Interesting. No bur ugh, burn. That's unfortunate. We may have to switch out. Um, we'll go into the next battle, but I think we're going to have to switch out because he's going to keep taking burn, and I don't want to lose a life on God. He does go to level 32, though. Does he learn something? Nothing. Takes a little... Oh, that was a decent chunk of burn damage. Glaceon, okay, so Glaceon will be sent in. We are going to switch. And we will bring in Sofa King, I think. You know. <laughs> well, what's weird is that kind of fits. Glaceon just hardens the ice around itself. Like, that doesn't feel like it's too outside the realms of being a real move. You know, like, you know, like Glaceon's just like, well, okay, got, my body's made out of ice. Let's harden it. You know, it makes sense. Weavile, okay, so we're gonna bring back in Arceus just to switch him out. There's Revile. Okay. Yeah, because if we can get him to like level 33, 
um, and he can learn another move, a good move, hopefully, you know, we'll be cooking. Low kick. Yeah, that's fine. Mega punch. Protein, fire type. He dodged it. Fantastic. Mega punch. We do have to remember, Sofa King's already down a life, and each mon only gets three lives. Um, so down, Revival goes. Level 33. Nothing. Precious Snake, level 37. Let's go. Articuno, there it is. There's a legendary. You know, I just realized if any of these guys have a, a arena trap, we could be in trouble. I didn't think about the randomized abilities. Sending him in this entire time has been, so, we've been so reckless. You know, and I've been so reckless. We, I'm dragging you in with me, guys. I've been so reckless. I didn't even, I didn't even think about that for half a second. Uh, I'm sorry, who said you get to do that? You know what, take a sacred fire. Amnesia, okay, yeah, okay, yeah, okay. Well, I'm a fire type, avoided the attack. Oh, yours. We're gonna focus blast you in the face. Work up? Damn, dude. This Articuno is stacking. I have to be careful. Come on, hit the focus. I'm missing. Smog. That did very little. I'm poisoned though. Of course I am. There we go. Focus blast. That should have That did nothing. It's a flying type. I'm an idiot. I'm thinking purely ice. Okay, we need to get him out of here. Our Pokemon are so low, dude. And who's the Pokemon we'd use as a sacrificial piece? You know, I guess our HM Mon, if we need to. Uh, let's Dark Void. Put him to sleep. It's an ice type and it's flying. So let's just sludge it and see if we can't get some damage off. And if he does wake up, oh, there he goes. He has roost. Are you kidding me? Are you kidding? This Articuno is going to be the most annoying mon to ever fight. Sludge. Now I'm hoping for the poison. There we go. Roost all you want. The smog doesn't do a ton of damage. It's the poison I have to watch out for. So we're, we're, all of our mons are just getting poisoned. The big thing here though is Sludge should do more damage now that it's poisoned if I remember correctly. Smog. Actually, I think I kill. I think I kill here. I think I just brought him down in range. Hyper Potion, of course. You know, if we want to play those shenanigans, I can play those shenanigans too. You know, and I think I am going to play these games. Let's play these games. Um, Actually, I should have just healed his health. I shouldn't give him both, but he healed the poison. It roosts. That's fine, actually. So what I can do here is just be the cheesiest guy ever. Because you're going to get hurt by that poison. I'm no longer poisoned. So we are just going to soda pop him up. We can't put him to sleep. Maybe. Take that poison damage. Thousand. Ah, uh, no, I was thinking about the thousand arrows that brings it down to the ground. Damn. I was totally thinking the wrong move. 
It's not a thousand rave, it's the arrow one. Smog me, that's fine. Don't poison me. Uh, crit and a poison, of course. You know what? I'm thinking about taking a risk here. And I'm gonna do it. I'm bringing out Precious Snake. Because Precious Snake has something that will definitely help. You roost? That's fine. Go ahead, buddy. You roost up. You're not full health, and poison brings you back down a little. And all eruption. That did nothing. It's because he's boosted. Oh my god, this thing's so annoying. And you're roosting. God, do I just... Let's eruption again. How many ro roost is five? So it's roosted like three times. I didn't get poisoned. Look at that. Oh no, roost is ten. Shoot. I need like a crit. Damn, man, this roosting bird is annoying. My eventually roost will run out. So. We need like a big crit. Avoided the attack, that's big. Precious Snake is just owning, dude. You roost again. This is an annoying battle, dude. That poison damage is really doing work. Yes, Relic Song. Look how majestic she is. That did nothing. I'm avoiding attacks left and right. I also have Roost, so I can play this game. Actually, what I should be doing if I'm smart is healing my other Pokemon. Because this thing will run out of Roost eventually. It's missing every single attack on me. And its poison will eventually bring it down. I can I can outlast this thing. I'm just going to keep Dragonair dancing. Because it's got to use, what, seven Roosts by now? You work up again, that's fine. You're not dealing much damage. Head charge would probably do more, but also would damage me. I'm afraid of this thing taking a big hit. Avoided. Damn. Damn. Precious Snake is just caring. Oh, I relic songed. So we know that he's gonna roost. Yep. It's gotta be almost out of roosts, right? It's, it's, I mean, what? Maybe one left? Like, cause this, these things don't get unlimited PP, does it? There's no way. That'd be hacks. Oh, smog hit. Didn't do anything to me though. So let's roost myself. And bring myself to four. Smog, as long as I don't get poisoned. Okay, I, I jinxed that. I jinxed that myself. But Precious Snake has been dodging it pretty much. Let's just straight up grab that other berry. You're gonna roost again, that's fine. It's gotta be out of roost by now, dude. It's you so many guys. I cannot imagine this thing still having any more roost. We're gonna Relic Song. We're just gonna riddle this thing down. We're gonna play this thing smart, and we're not gonna lose this battle. 
You smog again. Okay, I'm gonna roast. Yeah, this should not have any more roosts left. Cause I've used two now and it's it's gotta be used almost all of it. Are you kidding me? Relic song. Poison damage, we know this, that poison ship. It just can't, it, it shouldn't be able to use roost anymore. Interesting. That was a crit on me, I definitely need a roost this time. I roost, we know it's moveset. So if it's out of it didn't. It must be out of roost now. So I just roost again. Yeah, you roost. I now get a roost, buddy. Let's play this game. And guess who's going to win this battle? I avoided the attack. You get poison. Its defense went up a little bit. Do I head? I'm going to head charge. Try to s secure this win. And there we go. Yep, I don't know how much damage that would have done. I probably could have secured it earlier, but I think I played it safe. And I think we got out of there with a lot of experience. Silver King, 46. Kiram. Who, oh, who guards? Literally did not get a single move out of any of that. We are gonna get a TM from here though. God, could you imagine if it was like a decent move? Like Bolt Switch or... Crush Grip. The more HP the target has left, the greater the move powers. No, I don't think so. Okay, we're gonna back out and go heal our Pokemon up right away. We got out of there, we got the next badge, guys. That's a massive clutch. Um, kinda disappointed truthfully that we didn't gain a single new move out of some decent leveling in my opinion but you know what our mons are getting up there i mean technically yeah arceus and snake are our lowest leveled but i feel like everyone did their work i think arceus will start in and if we need to swap them out we will just to gain experience, but let's keep moving, guys. We still easily have some more time this episode. Let's keep moving. Um, gotta go back the way we came in the previous episode, but you know what? We got that gym badge. I should probably save why I am thinking about it. Six gym badges, two left, guys. We 86 Pokemon ain't bad. Let's keep moving. We'll just go the long way around. And any trainer battles we find will be great for experience. Because um, under leveled is something I am concerned about. But yeah, we can't catch any more Pokemon on this route, so no reason to even try. Hey, buddy, let's battle. Do I have moves that can strike a flying Pokemon? <clears throat> um, no, I don't. Behold the flying Pokemon. Oh, actually, that'd be kind of creepy if that thing was hovering above you, just staring down at you. You know, that, I... Gotta be honest, I would be a little concerned if that thing just started staring at me. Oh, my audio almost cut out there for a sec. That was weird.
Boom. Little hit. I wonder if the leap's gonna give good experience. Not really. Absol, hey! Absol is a cool Pokemon. You awake? Just checking. Frost Chop. Oh, that hurt. I gotta be careful. We do kill here, though. Absol should give some great experience, though. Okay, I mean, 800 more, but come on, learn something. HM on. Oh. Okay, let's do soda pop. There you go, buddy. You're pretty much back up to full. You'll be fine. Level 34. Yeah, I want to get my Mons at least into the 40s, so... Okay, so we go this way. Not this way. We have a person there, we have a person... Oh, I didn't think they'd reach, I wanted to go see what else was here. I do think we have to go down, so I think we'll go fight the ninja, check that corner, and then wrap back around, I think. Oh, we can fly now, can't we? Oh, maybe we go visit all the previous shops really quick. I actually think that's something I would like to do. That actually might be a good idea. Knee alarm. Okay. That was a crit. Okay. I'm actually thinking that actually might be worth it. Um, I don't know why I missed ball there. But, um... It's one of those things that I think going back and seeing if we miss any decent TMs or any decent items that we couldn't afford before might be Technoblast. That looks like that might hurt. That did not. Okay. But yeah, I think maybe we should wait till we get to the next town for that because I don't want to have to go all the way back. Although it's not like it's that far of a journey. Geomancy. Doesn't matter, it's dead. That was scary. Yeah, thank you. Um, I actually think, let's go do it. Let's go back and make sure we're not missing anything. So, we can now fly. Um, I don't think the first few areas have anything, do they? I don't think so, but we'll double check. We'll go to all the towns and double check to make sure. So this one doesn't, um, I'm thinking maybe I should grab some more. No, let's save our money because we have like 8,000 to spend. Um, let's, uh, let's go do that. Because if, if, oh, sorry, I hit surf. If we have, t if two items are 10,000 a piece, you know, we were just at Pedalburg. Not too long ago, and I don't think there was a second seller in the shop. With only 28,000 though, if the two items are 10,000 a piece, we only could afford two items or two TMs. Um, so yeah, no one there. So I think, oh, we should also, now that I'm thinking about it, we should just fly back to, uh, Rustboro to see if he'll take those uh, items off of us. Because if if the uh, dude will buy our item, oh, we should probably heal our Pokemon right here really quick. 
Because if that guy will go and buy those ancient whatever items. Drink some juice. Um, that actually could be helpful for us. So let's see if he will. And then we'll go to the, poke, uh, the to the shop. Okay, buddy. Please buy my items. I so desperately wish you would buy my items. Cause can we go buy those things? So depending on how much he buys them for, he doesn't buy them. What in the world do I do with these? Relic items, then. Hold on, I'm looking this up, because I swear we sold it to that dude. Relic statue, Pokemon Omega Ruby. This can be exchanged for a large amount of cash in on Della Town only. Are you kidding me? So that's great. So on Della Town. Wait, on Della Town. I don't think there is an Undella Town. Oh wait, hold on. Did I read that right? So they have no use in Gen 6. So they are absolutely useless. It does say here though, references. Since Omega Ruby and Alpha Sapphire can be sold directly to Pokemon. It's for 30k. But we haven't been able to sell them. Hold on, I am so confused now. So I thought the old man might buy it. I, I never got confirmation on that. But it says ever since Alpha Sapphire and Omega Ruby, you can sell them to shops. Maybe you need to beat the Pokemon League first? That seems weird, though. Oh, not buy, sell. Can't buy that. Yep. Is there any extra items we can sell? Any extra items I have? We do have a power herb. That's interesting. Oh, we have another set dial that we can sell. That's 5,000. Mulch isn't that useful for us. Do you have an air balloon? Okay. Well, we got like 5k out of that. We can. If items are 10, if each TM is 10,000 each, uh, we just got the ability to purchase a third. So that's not too bad, but honestly though, I'm kind of disappointed by those things not being sellable. So I guess the next location, that doesn't have a Pokemon, does it? Because the Pokemon would show up. Dufour Town doesn't have one, okay. And then you don't. 
Let's try, let's try Fall Arbor Town. See if it has anything there. Um, so, yeah. You know, because there's if there's something here, there possibly is. What do you have? The Protector, Fluffy Tail, and X Defense. Thank you for absolutely nothing, kind sir. That was probably the worst selection of items I have ever seen. Um, didn't mean to hit restore. I'm over clicking. So at this point, this seems to be a waste of time. We can check out Lava Ridge, but I think we spent so much time there. I think they didn't have anything. So we can go just check really quick. Where's the Pokemon? Okay, so so this was a really waste of time because we know Marvel City, we know what's in that Pokemon, and maybe this one got updated with some more stuff after we won the badge. I doubt it works that way. Like more items became available, but let's go double check just to make sure. Um. The Pokemon shouldn't have anything. It should be the side shops that do. Oh no, there's a second guy here. Hold on. Quick balls. We'll pick up three more. Dire hit, Moonstone, Lucky Egg, Waterstone, Custom. Oval. Okay. Okay. So I mean. If anything, we could just come back and get more quick balls or stuff. Okay. So yeah, let's go in here and see if there's stuff here this time, guys. Um, yeah, cool, cool, cool. Do you have anything? Nope. Cool, what about you? Traveling TM shop. Grass not bulk up. Well, I mean, okay, but not really. Bulk up's okay, but we really don't need more, you know. Okay, Ice Rock, Mega Rise, King Rock, X Attack, Pink Scarf. Okay. Nothing here. Yeah, if my if my uh, if Fire Bay didn't have what it took, neither of my Pokemon will. Let's see here. Relic statue for zero because it's not useful. Satchet. I wonder if we could sell it here. Hold on. Razor claw, shiny stone. Okay. Nope. I wish there was a seller we could sell those to. Are you just dolls? Yeah, you are. Okay, what about you? Oh, you're just a decoration saw. So, yep. Disappointment, man. Okay, so there's nothing there. We know where everything is. Let's just go back to where we were. So Route 121 is going to be like the big next chance to catch more mods. But unless it's a legendary, are we really going to, you know, catch anything that replaces our team? Because they would either need, like, like, I don't know, protein such a good ability, no guards are a good ability. Unless they have a higher base stat total and a decent ability, Dragon Knight could be replaced. Um, if it's another high BST total with a really good ability, I guess Slow King could technically go... Or, you know, like, we could technically rotate out the no guard. Protean, I think, is a better ability than no guard, especially with the moves he has. So I think it would be Tyrantrum who would go. But yeah, no, it's this is tough. Like, it feels like we're not... I'm not doing enough. Okay, so let's go battle this person up here. So... 
literally walk straight up towards you and look at you and talk to you. And you're like, I bet you don't know where I am. I hope I literally destroy your Pokemon. I'm literally going to destroy your Pidgey. Take bombs in the face. Didn't kill it. Spore. That's annoying. That is really annoying. Let's send Press to Snake out. Let them get some experience. Camouflage. It's a grass type, you say? No, I'm not gonna be mean. <laughs> I could have literally blown up the bird, but I'm gonna be nice. Oh, it was a crit. Okay, maybe I wasn't as... <laughs> I'm just gonna hit it with a critical move. Glaceon. Okay, yeah, we'll bring back out... Arceus, just so he can gain some more experience. Because this Glaceon should give plenty. And if we can get level 35, that's pretty good. Glaceon comes out. We know this Glaceon. So Precious Snake will come in and eruption it to literal oblivion. Like. Double hit. Boom. Boom. Eruption. That did nothing. Why is that doing nothing? Let's just run like shot. Man, I feel like I'm missing something. Okay. Level 35, that's big. So hold on. Yaw Mask, we will bring back in. See if he'll actually wake up. So hold on. I know Dragonair has higher attack, but he still has 70 special at like level 100. Like his special on a physical, he can be a mixed attacker. Eruption is a special move, so I know it doesn't have the highest attack. The higher the user's HP, the more damage caused. It has 150 base power at max HP, but its power decreases proportionally to the user. Oh, I did not know that's truly how eruption worked percentage wise. That is interesting to know. All right, uh, can you wake up? Nope. Oh, actually, Focus Blast is a little scary. Uh, <laughs> especially against a normal type. Uh, very scary. Quick Attack. That's a lot less scary, to be honest. Uh, oh, it's a Ghost type, isn't it? Flame Charge. Okay, we are gonna roost. And then roll eruption. Flame charge did very little, so his speed can keep going up. We're still faster at this point. But now that we're a little bit stronger, eruption should do a decent amount of damage. Oh, focus blast. That could hurt a little. A little. I think I still think eruption kills. Quick attack. Oh, maybe after the quick attack. No, it should. It should still kill. Yeah, we're good. We're good. We're good. We've been good. We've been chilling. All right. There we go. Level 38. That's massive. Anyone want to learn any moves and level up? Nope. Okay. That's fair. That's fair. Not like we need good attacks, guys. Yep, I do want to cut. Thank you.
Oh, there it is. I might as well take some since I'm here. Boom. Thank you for more berries. Oh, this really, I gotta say, wasn't worth the cut, but you know, we'll take these berries. They're extra berries. I mean, can't go wrong with berries. Actually, hold on. Okay. Toughness, normal attack. Okay, special defense. Cover. Okay. Not too bad. Do we have a... Okay. Okay, so yeah, we wrapped that way, so we are gonna have to go this way. So. All right. So honestly, guys, this will be the last battle of the episode, and then we'll call it here, and we'll pick this back up next episode. It's a lily pop. Uh, I think let's let Arceus wake up, actually. This could be a good moment to allow Arceus to just wake up. Nope. God is still sleeping. How in the world do you wake up God? Spark. God, can you wake up now, please? Nope, oh, God is still sleeping. Okay. I, uh, gyro ball. Can you wake up now? Nope. When God wants to take a nap, God wants to take a nap. Gyro ball, that is kind of funny seeing the pop do that. I'm actually really, that's adorable. Can you wake up? Thank God, slap it please. And God just literally slapped a puppy. Okay. Wake up slap. Oh, it's Spark again. I was hoping to see a different move, truthfully. I want to see if it has any other silly moves. Oh, you got the para on me. That's actually annoying. Searing shot. Oh, that dog is pissed. And I slap you in the face. Boom. All right, guys. That's pretty much gonna wrap it up. I think what I'll do is in between the episodes why, you know, things are going, I'll just run back or fly back and heal them up and come back here, guys, so we can start the episode fresh, fully healed up. Uh, no one's gained anything, no levels. So I wanna thank you guys so much for watching. Till next time, tag out. I wanna give a special thank you to all my Patreon members, Urza and Scott, you're amazing. If you guys wanna check out Patreon and join it to get a shout out at the end, check Patreon down in the link to the description below. And you can also like Scott did, Make me re-record this. Don't